Hey there, Tarkov Adventurers. Welcome to Moral TV. Today, we're going to be diving into the details of the military checkpoint key in Escape from Tarkov, a key that opens up new doors on customs. This isn't one of those must-have keys for customs, but I guess it's a pretty cool spot to go to. For this specific spot, no one really ever looks at the first floor of it. Everyone looks up at the second because there's snipers that have can spawn up there, but if you're really trying to like surprise someone, it's a good spot to do it. It's lightweight, just like every other key point, one kilograms, it takes up a one by one grid space in your inventory. Now let's see where we can find this key. So if you want to find this key, it's going to spawn in most places you'll find up on the wall in jackets. Uh, if you go ahead and search those, there's a chance it could spawn in there. Also in drawers, they're also known as filing cabinets, but um, you go ahead and search those little drawers one by one, you might just find a key. Now another place you can get it is whenever you kill a scav, go ahead and loot their pockets or their backpacks and there's a chance for it to spawn in there. But if you're looking for a static spawn, this one does have one. It's going to be next to the dead scav, just laying down the couch in the boiler building next to the east side of customs. But if you're looking at the map, it's called Warehouse 7, and it's on the far east side, just on the southeast side of it. Now, where's this lock at? The military checkpoint key unlocks the door at the end of the main road on customs, leading to the military checkpoint tower. It's going to be the first floor of that. So what I mean by the main road is that there's only one road that's the largest, and it's a pretty much straight line east to west of the map. It goes across the main bridge, but if you keep following that all the way down east, you'll come across here. This is the checkpoint. Now here is where the sniper scab can spawn up on the top there, sometimes inside, sometimes just out on the railings. But it unlocks this door right here. And once you go in behind this locked door, you'll find some valuable loot. A weapon rack, a grenade box, and two wooden ammo boxes. So if you're looking to get some ammo, grenades, possibly a gun, it's a good spot for you to loot in customs. So as for this key's quest involvement, it's going to be with Therapist on the quest Trust Regain. And not everyone's going to get this. If you completed Out of Curiosity instead of doing Big Customer or Chemical Part 4, you won't have this quest. But if you chose to go with Chemical Part 4 or Big Customer, you're going to have to do this. So all you have to do for this with this key is you just turn it in. You don't have to go there or anything in person. You just turn it in. That's it. Buy it off the flea, scavenge it, whatever. Just hit the little turn in button next to them, you know? So for this key's trading involvement as well, if you have skier max wrapped in all the way up to the elite level, you're able to turn in the key along with some other items with the uh, SGC-10, you know, here's the checkpoint key, the pro kill, two of them, and then, I don't know, a big chunk out of a square, two of them, and you'll be able to get yourself the M2 sword. And if you're not looking to trade in the key, you can actually get the key out of a trade. So if you have Jaeger Reputation level 2, which is fairly easy to get, that's pretty quick, you can get that. Um, you're just going to need two manuals, four vodkas, and two Tashankas, the mini ones, the little small ones. You'll be able to trade it in for the checkpoint key. And now that's your comprehensive guide to the military checkpoint key. And while on this journey, if you found something interesting, go ahead and share your findings down in the comments below. If you have any questions, go ahead and ask. For more talk of guides, stay tuned to Mortal TV, and well, I'll see you later. Be posting a lot more keys soon. Consider subscribing if you're looking into more Tarkov guides and you're just new trying to learn all the things out. It's nice to view a little key video now and then. Well, if you didn't like it, give it a dislike, but don't give it a dislike. It's fucked up. But, you know, up to you. I wouldn't judge you. Just a little bit. I wouldn't judge you. Just, just, just do it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know what that was, man. I, I can't. I, I gotta get an outro done. But whatever. See you later, man. Bye-bye.